Good day, welcome to Unity with Heaven. My name is Joseph, and today I want to take the time to pray for five people. The first person I would like to pray for is Anamiri Stareidom. Anamiri, uh, the Lord loves you very, very much. Just like you soak leather or a piece of wood in oil, and all that oil just goes into that wood. Uh, and into the leather and it makes it soft and supple i felt the lord is saying daughter i'm taking you and i'm putting you in the oil of the holy spirit so that my oil can go into you into the very essence of who you are and you become soft and supple pliable in my hands uh, and you become just a um, a guide for god's love to flow out of you uh, you become uh, this soft and cozy blanket uh, that can uh, drape over someone's life. And when people come in contact with you, they feel encouraged and they feel love. And I feel the Lord is doing a fantastic work in your life. The Lord says, daughter, I'm with you. I will protect you and I will keep you safe. You are in my hands. You are not uh, separate. You're not rejected, but you are loved and accepted in me. So I want to pray for you. Father, I, I bless Anamari. Lord, I pray, Lord, for your blessing, for your comfort, for your protection, and for your love, for your anointing to be poured out over the life of Anamari. Lord, thank you that you are before her and you're behind her, next to her, you walk with her, you speak with her, and she can clearly hear your voice. She can see the, the protection and the love of God all around her. And so, Lord, I pray now for that um, aroma of the presence of God to be in her house and Lord every uh, place of death that the way the enemy wants to bring death against her Lord I, I uh, stand against that and Lord I come into agreement with the, the plan and the purpose that you have for Anna Marie Lord I bless her in the name of Jesus and I declare that uh, this coming year is going to be a fantastic year in Anna Marie's life Anamiri, uh, God bless you, um, me and Claire love and we appreciate you and we, we love how uh, childlike you are before God. You just love Him with everything that's in you and you just want to please the Lord and the Lord is so pleased with you. God bless you Anamiri. So the next uh, person I want to pray for is Cindy Burton. Uh, so Cindy, uh, the Lord is showing me a big gate that is opening Although you could see through the gate, you know, some gates uh, got those uh, metal there you can see through, but it's not open. And I felt you saw the vision, you could just not access it. Uh, but I see how the Lord comes and he unlocks it. He says, it's time. I'm giving you breakthrough. You've passed the test. And so the Lord is opening up that gate. And I believe the Lord is giving you new access and uh, new resources. I want to pray for you, Father. I come and I pray for Cindy today. Lord, thank you that you are opening up a new opportunity, a new way, a new season in her life. And Lord, I pray now for your blessing and your protection and breakthrough to rest upon her life. Lord, pour out the anointing of God that breaks every yoke. Lord, that you will not carry the old uh, into the new, but Lord, that everything will be new in her life. Lord, thank you also that you are making her a fantastic mother. Uh, and uh, uh, a, a, a carer, someone that, that, that brings love and comfort into the lives of others. Lord, uh, you're raising uh, her up as a mature woman of God, and I bless her in the name of Jesus. Okay. Cindy, God loves you very, very much, uh, and I just see how Jesus just comes and he wraps his arms around you, and how you are close to him. Okay. God bless you, Cindy. Uh, so, uh, I want to pray for Ori, uh, McFarlane, okay, Ori, uh, God loves you, uh, and uh, I I see how uh, in Psalm 91 we it talks there about I find my shield under the wings of God. I see how the wings of God are spread over you, your your family, uh, over your land where you are, and how the Lord just closes His wings over you, and how as you stand under the wing of God, how you draw from Him protection, healing and resources and supply and how the lord is so faithful towards you all right um uh, you are hidden in christ under the wing 
of God and you do not have to fear. All right, let me pray for you. Uh, Father, thank you for Ari, Lord. Thank you for her faithfulness, uh, her heart to seek after you, to follow after you. And Lord, I pray now for the healing of God, for the restoration, for the protection, uh, for the resources of the Lord and the breakthrough of God to be upon her life. And Lord, thank you that you've given her a voice even from a young age, a voice of reason, a voice of wisdom. And so Lord, thank you that that voice will continue to ring loud, just like a trumpet that blows the shofar, that blows the, the, the word of the Lord. So Lord, her mouth will be a shofar that will declare the words of God. And so Lord, I bless her. Lord, I pray today, Lord, for a, a new, a fresh crown of joy to be placed on Ori's life, on her head, Lord, and that she will bubble over with the joy of the Lord. In the name of Jesus, I bless her. Ori, I love and appreciate you. Uh, you've been such a blessing to me and it's wonderful for me to just have the opportunity to pray for you today. Uh, God bless you. Uh, so the next person I want to pray for is for Bridget. Uh, so Bridget, uh, the Lord is just taking you up to the next level and then to the next level and then to the next level i see like a, a a tall building with levels and you go up with the elevator to a level there you learn you train you influence but you also get a new uh, authority you you receive word from god instructions these angels around you and then once you've learned you go to the next level and so the lord says uh, what you've learned right now is just a level there's so much more to learn so much more to grow so much more authority that god wants uh, for you and so there is a governmental anointing and authority that god is expanding on your life and i just want to pray for you father i come and pray for Bridget. lord i pray now lord that you'll protect her lord protect every thought that's going on in her mind lord no negativity and uh, no thoughts that's not in the line with the way you think but lord i pray lord that you will protect her and that you will teach her to walk in your ways and so lord she will not be rebellious against god but lord she will surrender and um, uh, uh, repent uh, and turn into that flow that river of god that you have for her uh, to function in lord i pray now for that governmental anointing to rest upon her and lord that she will be a, a, a woman of integrity that walk in the ways of god and so, Lord, just like Samuel was a judge uh, in the days uh, of Israel, Lord, so you raise up Bridget also as a judge and have someone that has the word of the Lord on her mouth. Lord, I bless her. Lord, I pray for your, your peace and your joy to flow overflow in her life. In the name of Jesus, Lord, you put your garments of righteousness on her. And I bless her now in the name of Jesus. Bridget, uh, there is so much potential that you are going to fulfill in your life and i see you like an arrow that are under that pressure and then the lord releases you to go to that next level so don't don't fear when you feel pressure in your life uh, that's all part of god bring that level of maturity in your life and also preparing you to launch you to the next all right god bless you bridget all right the next person i want to uh, pray for is sam so sam uh, i sometimes see you when you come on uh, f uh, on the prophetic nights when we prophesy but i also see uh, some of the comments that you post and i just want to say thank you very much it's wonderful for me that you are also part of the unity with heaven family and i just want to bless you um i want to enc encourage you to keep on letting your light shine uh, that prophetic and that um, evangelistic anointing that god has given to you to speak to others to call them into uh, the kingdom of god uh, don't let that flame die but just uh, keep on being excited about god and sharing sharing the light of god that is put inside of you with others uh, you're having a big impact on people's lives and the lord is maturing you at a fast rate i actually see a, a fire like a gas fire and you know most people are like the flame is like on level one uh, so that they can slowly but surely mature but i see how the lord turns it to level seven 
and he just matures you quickly because he has a lot for you to do and you are in the right place at the right time right now and so that's why he's putting on the fire for you to mature so that you can do all that wonderful work that God has for your life I also believe that the Lord is going to make you fruitful not only with ministry but also with finances and also in family having lots of children I don't know if you're married and have kids yet but I believe that is part of the promise that God is giving to you so Father I come and I bless Sam Lord I pray for a fresh anointing of the Holy Spirit upon his life uh, Lord uh, let that light that's inside of him shine let it not be underneath a bucket but let it be high and shine bright and touch many many people's lives Lord I pray now for financial breakthrough on his life also and uh, Lord also that you will make Sam fruitful uh, in every way I bless him in the name of Jesus Amen thank you Sam thank you family it was wonderful for me uh, to pray for these five people today if you want pray just in the comments just write uh, there uh, your name and uh, i'll also make sure to pray for you uh, have a fantastic uh, weekend and uh, i'll see you tomorrow again god bless